Um, they played us hard, and um, we came out, and our intensity was high, and it seemed like it slacked off just a little bit, and then we realized that we had to match it or, you know, if the outcome wouldn't be what we wanted, so. You guys jumped off to a really nice start in that first half. Kind of slowed down the second, but Coach said he was really happy with the way you guys played overall. Yeah, I, I agree. Um, we came out firing on all cylinders and uh, scored a few touchdowns. And uh, they came out with a different game plan in the second half from a different offense, and it kind of slowed down the pace quite a bit. And, uh, you know, there's not much we can do about that. They were running time off the clock, but, um, <clears throat> you know, we ended up pulling out with a victory. So. You guys played, going back to San Diego, played a great second half, played a great first half versus Marion. How do you guys keep the consistency throughout a game? You know, I think we're a great football team, but um, I feel like our we're still smoking. The fire hasn't lit yet. Um, we've got so much talent and ability. We just have to bring it all together and play that full four quarters rather than, you know, like the, the, the St. Ambrose who played two good quarters, uh, you know, so we got to get clicking. I think this is a week it's going to happen. We've had two good practices this week, so we're all fired up. You got Malone this week before another ranked team in Walsh. You guys worried about overlooking Malone at all, or what do you guys do as a team to avoid that? Just got to take one game at a time. Don't look, don't look too far ahead. You know, um, it doesn't do you any good to look ahead if you get beat the week before. So, what do you guys got to do with Malone against Malone? Um, just come out, and do our thing. You know, uh, play hard every snap. Um, just come out fired up.